Tale of Peter Rabbit by Helen Beatrix Potter. Four little rabbits, Flopsy, Mopsy, Cottontail, and Peter, lived with their mother in a sandbank underneath the root of a big fir tree. Run along, my dears. Remember, don't get up to any mischief. Don't go into Mr. McGregor's garden. Flopsy, Mopsy, and Cottontail, who always listened to their mother, went to gather blackberries. Peter, though, ran straight to Mr. McGregor's garden, where he ate some lettuce and some French beans. Then, feeling a little sick, he went to look for some parsley. Just around the end of a cucumber frame, he saw Mr. McGregor, who angrily jumped up and ran after him. Stop, thief! Peter was incredibly frightened. He ran as fast as he could around the garden, trying to find the way back to the gate. Peter ran into a gooseberry net and got caught by the large buttons on his new red jacket. Mr. McGregor came up with a rake, but Peter wriggled out of his jacket just in time and took off across the garden again. Peter Rabbit rushed into a tool shed and jumped into a can that was unfortunately full of water. Mr. McGregor was quite sure that Peter was somewhere in the tool shed, perhaps hidden underneath a flower pot. He carefully turned them over, looking under each one. Then Peter sneezed. Goodishoo! Mr. McGregor was soon after him and tried to catch Peter, who jumped out of a window. The window was too small for Mr. McGregor, and he was tired of running after Peter. Peter Rabbit moved from one place to the other, looking for the gate. Unfortunately, he had lost his way and could not get out of the garden. He asked a rat for directions. Ma'am, could you tell me the way to the main road? No, I can't. He even asked a cat. Don't disturb me, I'm busy. Suddenly, he saw Mr. McGregor hoeing his onion patch, and just beyond him was the gate. Peter sprinted across the onion patch and slipped under the gate. Thank God I found the gate. Let me run home to Mother. Peter flopped down on the nice soft sand on the floor of the rabbit hole and shut his eyes. Why, Peter? What's the matter? I got lost in McGregor's garden. I'm sorry, Mother. I should have listened to your warning. I'm sorry to say that Peter was not very well that night. His mother put him to bed and made him some tea. Flopsy, Mopsy and Cottontail had bread, milk and blackberries for supper.